My name is Mike Rivers. I'm the project manager here at Fort Eustis on the Aviation Maintenance Instructional Building. This has been a great experience working with the Army Corps of Engineers, also the subcontractors, and the internal team as well. So one of the great assets that we have as a team is that we have chemistry. We were able to overcome a lot of obstacles. As we all know, the global pandemic has caused some great challenges, but when you work together and there's no iron team, everything works out fine. So in the high bay, we're getting closer to the finish line. As you can see, we have our bridge crane system. Uh, the bridge crane system can hold up to three tons. And basically what that does for the troops or students that will be learning on the helicopter aircraft, it'll allow you to have on the job training to be able to lift the aircraft parts up. Also in the high bay, you'll see up along the walls, you'll see a lot of disconnects. Those are special tube receptacles for the aircraft to plug into. You will also see the four large hangar doors. They come in four pieces. They're built on the ground and that's where the aircraft will be taxied in. So in the classrooms, that's where the troops will learn the theory behind the helicopter aircraft. Uh, there's large visual display boards in there. There's beautiful casework. To accompany the visual display boards will be large 84 inch screens so they can watch live video and instructions from different instructions around the world. On the exterior on the site work, uh, one of the bid options that we completed are the brick pavers. Inside the mechanical room, you have your cooling tower and you have two of your large chillers. I'm excited about the troops coming into this building. I know that they are really excited about the new career of working on helicopters and you know the building is really versatile. I mean, they're gonna see the helicopters in the high bay. They're gonna be in the classroom learning something new. And this actually helps, you know, the military and to be a part of something great.